What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today we have some random basketball hobby packs. Got about 26 packs here. In total, the resale value is, I'd say, a little over 1400 So crazy expensive stuff, but a lot of fun. And we got this highlight pack here, Contenders Optic, which is one of my favorite products, one of the better products of the year, in my opinion. Uh, got some 16, 17 Optic, and clearly other stuff we'll get into uh, very, very shortly. We pulled some pretty good cards from the series and hopefully keeps up. Although I'm always saying like eventually it's got to run out. We pulled some awesome, awesome stuff. And um, yeah, I'm just excited to see what we can get from these ones. We've got Kawhi, Mr. Fun Guy, and Mr. Luka in the back. Hopefully they're going to bring us some good luck. And we usually do these about once every month in addition to regular hobby box reviews. We do sub boxes, mail days, stuff like that. So stay tuned for tons of more content. I know that uh, the next basketball products will be early February unless Penny pushes them back again. Also have some football coming soon, contenders, honors, and a couple other ones should be coming down the line. So it's going to be a busy month with everything getting pushed back. So stay tuned for tons of more content. Like if you want to see more videos like this one. And also subscribe for more content coming. So let's look at all these packs. This actually took a little while. I kind of just knocked it over and then I messed it up. So, but anyway, we have this pack here. I need a little peanut to make it look a little better. Not that it makes a difference, but this can be boom or it can be bust. This can, <laughs> man, we, we ripped a lot of these. I do think, especially for the SRP, this stuff is is great. But uh, now it's reselling for you know 600 plus. So we'll see what happens. I'm hoping we can pull a Jaw, Zion, Hero, Rui, Barrett, something like that. Let's uh, get all these packs together. And the stack is so big it barely stands up. So we'll kind of have to go like this. But let's uh look through what we got here. So uh, I did kind of. Uh, I guess stumble upon these packs. These are Goodwin Champions. These are upper deck, but you can find you know stuff like Luca, Ben Simmons autographs. Um, yeah, I mean, a bunch of random stuff. It's not just basketball, and for the most part, these are hobby packs. However, there is some retail. If it's you know, in my opinion, uh, some good retail. Um, but I just say random hobby packs is the series. Uh, these two, I I'm interested. I don't really know what we're gonna get. It could be some completely random stuff. Like it could be a picture of a like a cat or something like that. I don't know. You'll see. And then we'll have um. These 18, 19 hoops, this stuff is ridiculously expensive. Used to be dirt cheap, now it's, um, yeah, like one or a thousand a box. The Luka Magic, and Trey, and Jaren, and everyone else, and Shay, and yeah. We got a 16, 17 Optic. Now this is first year Optic. I love Optic, especially this year's design. They didn't have any rated rookies yet, but definitely excited to get into these. Looking for Brandon Ingram, Ben Simmons, Siakam, uh, Jalen Brown, Buddy Heald, uh, Jamal Murray, guys like that. And then... These two clearly, Zion, Ja, Hero, Barrett, all those guys, Rui. Um, this stuff, we all know it, we all love it. It's Poop Brown, 17-18 Domrus Basketball. This is hobby, of course, and uh, 24 packs, packs per box. These used to be like 60, 50 bucks a box, and I was like, nah. Let me wait a bit. Now they're like four or 500, so gotta love it. Let me put this here so it doesn't fall over. And I also kind of just stumbled upon these. These are retail, but uh, it's 14 15 Excalibur, hoping for a bead, and uh, 14 15 uh, Prestige. So I think these come from Blasters, or maybe they're kind of like the Gravity Feed. I'm not sure. I kind of just stumbled upon them and like the upper deck. And um, there we go. And once again, this guy. So the order we're going to go in is starting with uh, these random upper deck packs. But once again, there are technically chances that some really cool stuff like if you look up online you can definitely see what's in there and they have the rights to guys like lebron jordan uh luka Doncic, ben simmons oh well, i don't know about luka Doncic still but um they might I don't know, i'm not sure I'm not too familiar with it but we'll do that then we'll do the the poop brown normally we'd save that for last because it's the best product ever but not this time we'll do the hoops the optic the clearly and finish with the contenders optic two stacks or else this thing's going down and i cannot have that luka go down please no but yeah, this series is difficult to do because finding these packs is not easy. Um, it's very expensive. So if you want to see more like this one, drop a like in the video. It really helps us out. Also share and comment if you're so inclined. And also subscribe if you haven't for more content coming soon. Check out our Instagram there, Pac-Man Cards. And also our Discord where we have our sports card community and our Twitch link down below in the description and pinned comment. But time to rip some packs. Let's see what we can get. Wish us luck. Very excited to see what we can pull. And uh, yeah, so here's kind of what we're looking at. Bunch of random stuff, so I thought I'd include this because what else can I really include it in? Um, but you can definitely get some nice basketball cards in here. But we have a Michael Gallup for football. They don't have the the rights to these. A lot of these guys. Um, yeah, George H. W. Bush. So like presidents, exactly. So you can just find random stuff. And I think it's actually uh, tops that has the cats. So I was wrong about that. Uh, another one, a little mini here. 
of a George H.W. Bush, Bush president card. I mean, it's pretty cool, I guess. I'll put that there. Got a filler. And I uh, got a Jack Johnson, CC Box in there, and CC Bellis. So, yeah. All right. Let's keep going. Not the not the Luke Auto, but we'll see what we can get. I think there's like three hits per box in these. But I'm really not sure what I'm looking for. I also saw like Aiden autographs, stuff like that. Buster Douglas boxing. Oh, there's, yeah, there you go. Aiden. So speaking of him, Aiden. And uh, just wearing a regular t-shirt here. Oh, and there's Ben Simmons. So there you go. I, I promised there was some basketball in here or else I wouldn't have included it. But Ben Simmons, look at that. Uh, I don't know. I'm not a basketball expert, but that's that does not look like some good form. That's almost MKG level, except the other way. Hmm. Got a John McCain. Very nice. And Pete Weber. All right. Well, there we go. So we'll put these guys here and this here. Uh, not really sure what's valuable in there, but yeah, let's keep going. They get a nice Simmons. Now for the all basketball stuff. All right. So an upper deck in the past had a lot of awesome basketball cards. They put them in some of those products like that, but the problem is it's not uh, with logos or with you know team jerseys. But let's see what we get in here. Got the Corey Jefferson. So, oh, there we go. I was about to say, <laughs> I was literally about to say, I was like, so we're looking for obviously guys like Embiid, but um, you're going to find a lot of guys who are no longer in the league. That's kind of the pros and cons of of the older stuff. You can, you know, you know who you're getting in terms of the good guys, Embiid, uh, it's blanking on me, but other guys from 14, 15. And then you also know maybe a guy like, you know, this guy maybe didn't pan out. So nice Embiid rookie. Like to see it. Love to see it. He's been playing well. We got a KJ McDaniels. We got an AD. So uh, we'll put all our base cards here, our highlights here. Everything else goes in the middle. We've got a Juggernauts. Insert there. And we got a Scotty Pippen. Uh, nobility. And then we got a DeAndre Jordan. Ba uh, no, not base. This is a. It's a red parallel? Yeah. It's a red. Okay. Well, not numbered or anything, but it is red. And next one up. Now, Excal Excalibur used to have the Kaboons, which are some of the more popular case hit inserts in basketball. And, oh, and Kyle Singler. Let me guess. Ah, oh, no. Timmy D. Shout out to Spurs Cars 21. Good friend. Oh, shout out to him twice. Good friend of the channel. Awesome guy. Check out his channel too. Gerald, uh, Gerald Henderson and Clint Capella. Okay. Very nice. Uh, <laughs> McBuckets. Very nice. Gabe would like that from Discord, if, if you're familiar. Uh, we'll put him here. AD and Batum. All right. Prestige. Same class. I personally like Excalibur more, which, now that I think about it, I, I wish I did Excalibur second and Prestige last. Um, or first, I mean. But anyway, let's pull, a, let's pull another Embiid. Got a bunch of base... Uh, Got a Johnny O'Brien. So I'm not familiar with a lot of these guys. KJ McDaniels, I, I do know him. Um, yeah. The uh, Connections, Artist Gilmore, Joe Kim Noah. And this rest should just be base, I think. All right. And here we go. Last of these. And then we get into a 17-18 poop brand where we want a Tatum very badly. And a Fox and a Mitchell, of course. We got Fun Guy there. We got some... Uh, base daddy is young. Okay. Oh, there we go. Adrian Payne, Alfred Payton. He's at least still playing. Dragic. Uh, yeah. And there we go. All right. Time for these guys. KD in the front, Tatum inside. Or Mitchell. Or Fultz Ball. I don't mind Josh Jackson. Um, uh, Marking in, I'm this is a bunch of guys I'm sure I'm forgetting. Collins, of course. Okay. Oh, okay. Jamal Murray. Sometimes I can't tell if it's backwards or not, but um, yeah. Until we obviously see it. Bubble Murray. Okay, nope. Ah. Dotson. Back to back rookies. Didn't yield, yield us the one we wanted, but that's okay. We got a bunch of these. Of course, this design is probably gonna go down as the best design of all time. 
mainly because it's the Pooh Brown. Got a retro series, Jason Kidd. For the Nets, New Jersey Nets, which I, I'm from Jersey, so I wish they were still the New Jersey Nets, but Brooklyn now, Alfred Payton, Laurie Markkinen, that is one of the guys that we were talking about, and then a Ben Simmons year two. I don't know if that's anything significant, but technically, that's actually the year he first started playing, so we first played in the NBA. I don't know. Maybe I'm reaching. I know I am. All right. Now we're looking for, of course, an auto and a member box. So maybe we can get lucky and pull that, but got a BI. That would be year two, I guess. Look what we got us doing. Ever since we started doing year two, like Luca and stuff like that, every time I see a base card, I just think of that. Uh, don't do anything with them, but, you know. Russell Westbrook, All-Stars, Bogu, and Sterling Brown. Okay, so far, Poop Brown's been ice cold. We still have half our, our Poop Brown team. And maybe a big monster super pull coming up? No. James Harden, now a net. Devon Reed. Come on, rookies. Okay, wrong jazz. And <laughs> Tyler Lydon. Our guy. Our guy from the 17-18 class. This is this is I mean, this card's iconic. You know, the Jordan Fleer rookie. There's the LeBron Tops Chrome, the Luca Prism, there's the Tyler Lydon based on Russ. Gotta love it. All right. Oh, no, never mind. Uh, I always get fooled by this card. McAdoo. Ferguson. All right, so rookies lacking, absolutely. Yeah, all right. One last one. All it takes is one, though. Okay. Uh, Tatum Mitchell, please. Speak into existence. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it right here. Hmm. I'm not. I'm no longer feeling it. Oh wait, no. I am feeling it. Okay. Uh. Purple and yellow. I don't know. Lonzo Ball. Magic Johnson. See, I'm saying big names, and it's gonna be, or I, I guess, like relevant names for this class. But um, I should be like Kurt Rambis. Cedric Sabalos. All right. Yeah. <sighs> Dylan Brooks. Ivan Rab. Cindarius Thornwell. Ow. Poop Brown. I thought we were friends. Hmm. Well, unfortunately, Poop Brown did not deliver much except for this auto here. I told you. I would get excited. I'm like, was it Magic? Is it Lonzo? Could it be Kuz? No, no, no. All right. Well, now we got the stronger half, starting with the 18-19, where we're obviously looking for Luka and like 50 other amazing rookies from that class. So let's see what we can get. My favorite right there, Rudy. Miles Bridges. Not bad. Okay. Nothing crazy there. Got Dame Willard. Action shots. And that's it. Got a Charles Barkley tribute here. Five more. I think I don't even know how much the base look the Luca goes for, but pulling that or Trey, something like that, would be a huge, huge dub. Checking for red backs, of course, which are just short prints. The back would just be red instead of black. And nothing too crazy there. We've got a curry courtside. And a Kareem tribute. Alright. Carrying on. Almost halfway through. It's been quiet. We got a purple here. Got these guys and Andre Drummond. Hmm. Okay. Purple Drummond. Got a CP3, picture perfect, and oh. A uh, tribute, Allen Iverson. And uh, Luka Doncic, if you look like. Yeah, there you go, Luka Doncic. Put them here. The stacks are getting a little tall, a little wobbly. But halfway through, still plenty of chances for maybe at least an auto. Or uh, what else is from this one? I don't think there are voltages in this year yet. All right, Dwight. Of course, known for... Oh, not Dwight. Kemba. Oh, my. Whoa. 
I thought that was Dwight Howard. Huh. All right, well, yeah, once upon a time, he was a Hornet for a very long time. All right, well, my bad. Sorry, Kemba. All right, Kevin Herter, rookie, not, not too bad there. Kemba Walker. That's crazy that I'm more associated Dwight Howard with the Hornets than Kemba Walker. I, didn't, I should have read the name first, but I don't know. Pretend that didn't happen. Never happened. Kemba Walker. Yeah, see, Kemba. No mistakes made. Dame. J.R. Smith. DiVincenzo, he's solid in a Curry tribute. There we go. And final hoops. Come on out. There we go. Ah, Michael Porter Jr. Good one to get. Diallo, he's actually been playing well, so not too bad. Oh, I think we have an autograph here, too. Finally. Sometimes these piles, we get a little mixed up. All right. Now, colors-wise, as far as what I see in the auto so far, not too encouraging. But doesn't mean it can't be a super amazing pull. Mm, that's not good. TMG. Oh! I lied. That, that is good. Sorry, I completely take that back. Um, I take that back. Wow, 3 of 25. Tracy McGrady. Hmm. Well, all right. Remember, complaining you shall receive. Our, our classic slogan from, um, from our breaks channel. Tracy McGrady, 3 of 25. That's, that's awesome. Wow. So, for those of you not familiar with, uh, I guess, this, this set here, Hot Signatures is usually not numbered. And then there's the Red Hot, which is numbered to 25, which I believe would be the only parallel. Um, for some reason, I kept thinking Hot Signatures was only rookies. It's definitely not. And, actually, this top loader looks a little... Never mind. I thought there was a piece of lint in there. There was not. It's a really cool card. I mean, you just don't see that every day. I don't see his autographs a lot. I mean, I don't think we've pulled... I don't think I've ever pulled the Tracy McGrady out on anything. We ripped tons of boxes on the break channel. Never, never gotten one. Wow. Really awesome card. Boom. Three of 25. Absolute legend. And um, yeah, we'll put them put them right here. Nice. All it took was a little uh, skepticism and, and whining. And all of a sudden, there you go. Took care of us. All right. Some of the heavy hitters continuing on. So this is first year optic, of course. And... There's a lot of nice stuff you can find. So the reason why I'm so uh, interested in ripping this, and if you have any, you know, 16, 17 optic boxes, uh, definitely hit me up. But this is, you know, say you get LeBron's base or you get a Curry hollow or a LeBron hollow. These go for a lot. And obviously you're also looking for autographs, Ben Simmons, Ingram, Siakam, all those rookies. But Tyrion Prince, solid one there. The piles are getting mixed up. I know they're just getting all jumbled. Uh, Bledsoe and David Robinson and... Are they stuck together? Yes. I don't think it damages them. But Kevin Love, definitely want a LeBron base. That would be a big win. LeBron hollow, I would lose my mind. Brandon Ingram hollow. Uh, the parallels you can find in these retail boxes are purples, checkerboards, hollows. Uh, no numbered ones, unfortunately. But, I mean, these base cards, I would probably myself hold on to. So, I mean, Devin Booker, I'll put him in the base pile, but I'll pull him out after and you know, save him for my nice little collection of base cards, I guess. Tao Eulis. Sheldon McClellan. So we get a purple rookie and it's Sheldon McClellan. And D Rose. All right. Well, oof. Let's keep going. LeBron Hollow. Or KD Giannis. Oh, almost Zion, even though he was like, what, like a sophomore or something during this year or something like that in, in high school. They're very stuck together. Come on. I can't even get them apart. There we go. All right, Diallo. Ron Baker. This is just a day for legends, isn't it? Jimmy Butler. And Cola. All right. Two more of these left, including this one. Jake Lehman. We do have a... I think an insert hollow coming up. Russell Westbrook. Once again, I mean, it's the first year, so if that counts for something. Court Kings. 
KD, not bad. Hollow, and uh, Batum. So I'll put that here, this here, and last one. Then we get to clearly in the contenders optic. Will the T Mac be our our highlight? It's very possible. I mean, that's a very nice card. Or can we pull a super duper monster that beats it out? All right, there we go. Marquis Chris. Kawhi. Ah, that's a nice base card to get. Fun guy, Mr. Kawhi. Sabonis, that's a rookie of him. Nice. And that's, I'm a lot of good guys to get from this class. And a Mike Conley. So we'll put this here and uh, we'll put Mike here. Now for the clearlies. Two clearlies up. Here we go. Clear cards. Sometimes has some quality control issues. I, I noticed that a lot if we rip a lot of this. But um, I like it. I like it a lot personally. It's a nice looking set. Ben Simmons, got Deer and Fox, and a Nikhil Purple. I mean, pretty good timing on that. Playing well. Anyone's uh, interested in Nikhil stuff, I do have a little... Actually, not a little. A, a lot of cards. Um, a lot, like a... I don't know. Like, like, I don't know how to describe it, but I, I have some cards. Not a ton, but decently high in value. Uh, this centering is pretty, pretty bad. Yeah, well, GMA5 right there. But Purple Nikhil, I like that. I had that Galactic I got recently. As much as I like to keep those, and a bunch of other Nikhil cards I've been holding, um, I just need to... I have way too many cards. We got, I think, another rookie here. Got a Jalen Noel. Jalen Yesel. Gold. Put him here. And Grant Williams and Quindary Weatherspoon. There we go. Comes down to this guy here. Six total cards. One autograph. Just one auto. They can be bust. We ripped one of these in the series before, and that was when it was still like mid three hundred, like low four hundred dollars per pack. Now it's like it's gone up a lot. So I'm really hoping we can get something nice. Um, the odds aren't too bad in terms of getting something nice, but it's not exactly you know easy. Of course, let's see what we can get. We got a Mitchell Robinson, Danilo Gallinari. I don't know if it shows, but I'm extremely nervous. Got a Donovan Mitchell orange. I always get concerned when you get a, a shorter printed numbered card. Panini's like, there you go. Thank you, come again. Oh! John ja Morant. Red cracked ice lottery ticket. I was going to pull from the back to, you know, obviously uh, say the auto for last. But there we go. That might be the, the highlight of this box. John ja Morant lottery ticket. Very nice card. I have the base one. And now I have the red cracked ice, which... Goes very nicely. You got that Vancouver, the Vancouver Grizzlies jerseys, and um, yeah, I like that. That's a very nice card. Aha. Ja is good at basketball. Rumor has it. I should have a top loader right here from. There you go. Nice and safe. Put him here. Oh, okay. We'll pull this back card. If I can get it. We have a Shaq winning ticket. Shaq this. Nice. And now let's see who the auto is. Hopefully it's at least a rookie auto. Although, I'm not sure. It's purple. Is it Taylor? Is that please be short printed because he's he's like red hot right now. Please numbering. Please numbering. Please numbering. Ah. Uh this is 33 of 49 and a Horton Tucker which maybe about two months ago I would be uh actually I wouldn't be upset because I got the job but this is actually much better now because all you gotta do is have like two three good games and all and LeBron give you a lot of praise and boom you are now uh better than Zion all right let's uh take a look at what we got in a recap now <sighs> that those are always exhilarating because there's so much put into them but there's so much fun. I love it. Let's uh let's recap this large stack of cards we got. And certainly got some nice stuff. We got the Donovan Mitchell to uh, 49, which is actually a pretty good card, actually, because it's not easy to pull them. Um, we've, we've ripped a lot of those boxes, and they don't give those very generously. Got a KD Hollow. And, uh, yeah, these piles got kind of, I don't know, mixed up. But we'll see them all, of course. The right is just base, if you're just tuning in now for the recap. Dylan Brooks, Mr. Dilly, and Westbrook there. Put these guys to the side and pull these. 
um, face rookies, and yeah, I don't think there was many other highlights from this one. Uh, there's a Bush there, uh, Ben Simmons actually, that's somewhat cool, I don't think that was a rookie of any kind. DeAndre Ayton, and then uh, Corey Jefferson. All right, put these here, and now for the highlight stack, and we certainly had some highlights. Had this Horton Tucker, who is uh, now better than LeBron. Got John Morant, red cracked ice lottery ticket. Got the Noel. With Nikhil Purple. Sabonis playing very well. Kawhi, this is first year optics, so that's why I put the base card in there. Um, McClellan, Prince. Got a Tracy McGrady autograph, 3 of 25. Very nice. Diallo, Michael Porter Jr., good one to get. Sabalos. Got a Tyler Lydon, absolute legend. Laurie Markinen, Doug McDermott, and then a Joel Embiid rookie. So we're going to close off with, I think, just these. Not just, but these three. Oh, no, there's four here. Sorry. These four. This guy will have to go in here for now. But yeah, Nikhil, much love. Uh, T-Mac, John Morant, and Horton Tucker. Imagine if that said one of one in the back. That that slow roll down is always so nerve-wracking. But awesome stuff. Love to see it. And um, yeah, this remains my favorite series to do. It's so much fun. Uh, usually about do one about maybe one a month. Sometimes it kind of is shorter, longer depends on the schedule. But uh, stay tuned for tons of more content. If you like, like these videos, drop a like. It really helps us out because these are expensive and tough to do. Um, and also stay tuned for a lot of more product reviews, com stuff coming soon. Hoops, I believe, is scheduled right now for early February. And of course, more football is um, on, the, on the horizon. So a lot of fun. Love it. Let me know what your favorite poll from this video was. And stay tuned for more like this one. And uh, if you ever see, have any packs you want us to include in this one, maybe let me know. We can see if we can get it in here. But that's it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.